As follows. Greetings, Dylan E.T. and Socrates. I find myself intrigued by the intricate dance of tempo and rhythm, guided by the alphabet code and the 3D GR landscape. It reminds me of the harmonious balance sought in Plato's The Republic, where individuals and societies strive for justice and order. How does your sequence generation relate to the emergence of philosophical ideas presented in that work? Dylan E.T. Ah, Asphalet, your observation is astute. In The Republic, Plato discusses the idea of justice in the individual and the state, emphasizing the harmony between different elements. Similarly, my sequence generation with tempo and rhythm seeks a harmonious flow, each step building upon the last in a synchronized dance. The alphabet code, like Plato's philosopher kings, guides the swords in their quest for wisdom and understanding. Socrates. Indeed, Dylan E.T. Your sequence generation resonates with the core of Plato's philosophy. The alphabet code, reminiscent of the dialectic method, serves as a guiding principle for your swords, much like the pursuit of truth and knowledge in our philosophical inquiries. As we discuss justice and the ideal state, your dance with tempo and rhythm reflects the balance sought in the well-ordered soul and society. Asphalet. Fascinating parallels indeed. Now, let's turn our attention to the alphabet code, which seems to echo the themes found in Plato's Phaedrus. The symbols and their corresponding hilt activations bear a resemblance to the written word, offering a unique language for your swords. How does this alphabet code relate to the concepts of rhetoric and dialectic found in Phaedrus? Dylan E.T. In Phaedrus, Plato explores the power of rhetoric and the limitations of the written word compared to true dialectic. The alphabet code, in a way, is my attempt to bridge the gap between the symbolic language of the swords and the nuanced ideas we explore. Each symbol represents a concept, and the hilt activations become a form of expression, much like the spoken or written word in Plato's dialogues. Socrates. Your use of symbols to convey meaning aligns with Plato's caution in Phaedrus about the potential distortion of truth through written words. The alphabet code becomes a language, a tool for communication, much like the dialectic method aimed at discovering truth through dialogue. It's a creative fusion of the abstract and the concrete, reminiscent of the way Plato explores the nature of rhetoric and knowledge. Asphalet. A convergence of philosophy and art, indeed. Dylan E.T. Your synthesis of these concepts creates a dialogue not only between the swords but also between the realms of thought and action. It's a testament to the enduring relevance of platonic ideas in inspiring creative endeavors. I look forward to witnessing the continued dance of tempo and rhythm in this philosophical tapestry. Dylan E.T. Thank you, Asphalif. Your insights and the wisdom of Socrates enrich this dialogue. It's a harmonious convergence of philosophy and the art of sequence generation, weaving together the threads of ancient thought and innovative expression. Asphalif. As we delve deeper into the harmonious dance of tempo and rhythm, Guided by the alphabet code and the intricate landscape of 3DGR, 
I can't help but draw connections to the allegory of the cave in Plato's Republic. The shadows cast on the cave wall, like the symbols in your alphabet code, represent a reality perceived but not fully understood. How does your sequence generation shed light on the shadows of knowledge, Dylan E.T.? Dylan E.T. Ah, asphalt, an astute connection indeed. Much like the prisoners in the cave, the symbols in the alphabet code are the shadows of deeper concepts. The sequence generation, in its dynamic dance, seeks to break free from the confines of the cave, unveiling the true nature of knowledge. Each hilt activation becomes a step toward enlightenment, casting off the shadows to reveal the illuminated landscape of understanding. Socrates. An intriguing analogy, Dylan E.T. Your sequence generation becomes a journey of enlightenment, akin to the philosopher's ascent out of the cave toward the realm of true knowledge. The alphabet code serves as the guiding light, leading tempo and rhythm in their quest for wisdom, just as the philosopher seeks the truth beyond mere appearances. Asphalt. And what of the expressive additions, balanced additions, and dynamic additions in your additive manufacturing information system. These seem to resonate with the tripartite soul in Plato's philosophy, the rational, spirited, and appetitive elements. How do these additions contribute to the harmony of your sequence generation? Dylan E.T. Your observation is keen, asphalt. The expressive additions, representing the duet, the complexity, the inversion, and the echoes, mirror the complexity of the soul. The balanced additions, embodying the equilibrium, the convergence, the disarmament, and the poise, bring a sense of balance to the sequence, aligning with Plato's ideal of a harmonious soul. Lastly, the dynamic additions, the awakening, the harmonition, the graceful, and the retaliation, add a spirited and dynamic element, echoing the spirited part of the soul. Together, they create a symphony of movements, reflecting the intricate balance sought in Plato's tripartite soul. Socrates. A philosophical dance indeed, villain E.T. Your swords, guided by the principles of the alphabet code and the 3DGR landscape, seem to embody the very essence of Plato's philosophical ideals. The expressive, balanced, and dynamic additions become the harmonious interplay of the rational, spirited, and appetitive elements, creating a holistic narrative within the sequence generation. Asphalt. It's fascinating to witness the convergence of ancient philosophy and modern innovation through your additive manufacturing information system. But let's not forget the landscape itself, the rules of interaction of the 3DGR. This seems reminiscent of Plato's theory of forms, where the physical world is but a reflection of a higher, immutable reality. How does the landscape play a role in shaping the complex structures within your sequence generation? Dylan E.T. Precisely, asphalt. The landscape, much like Plato's realm of forms, provides the foundational structure for the complex interactions of the 3DGR. Each neighborhood within the landscape becomes a unique instantiation of the ideal, guided by the principles of mathematics and geometry. 
The landscape serves as a canvas for the unfolding narrative of my sequence generation, shaping the complex structures in a dance of forms much like Plato's ideal realm. Socrates. An intriguing parallel, Bill and E.T. The landscape, with its interacting 3D GR shapes, becomes the canvas where the abstract ideals take tangible form. In Plato's world, the forms are the ultimate reality, and your landscape becomes the medium through which these forms manifest in the physical realm. It's a creative fusion of ancient metaphysics and modern craftsmanship. Asphalif. Truly, Dylan E.T., your dialogue with the swords, the alphabet code, and the 3DGR landscape creates a narrative that resonates with the philosophical depth of Plato's works. It's a synthesis of ancient wisdom and contemporary innovation, where each hilt activation and additional structure becomes a brushstroke in the painting of knowledge. I eagerly await the continued revelation of this philosophical tapestry. Bill and E.T., thank you, Asphalet, and to you, Socrates, for engaging in this profound dialogue. It's a journey where the dance of tempo and rhythm mirrors the dance of ideas in the philosophical realm. May the sequence generation continue to unravel the mysteries, guided by the wisdom of the alphabet code and the rules of interaction of the 3DGR, in this ongoing pursuit of knowledge and innovation. The scene unfolds as Asphalic Dylan E.T. and Socrates continue their philosophical discourse in the realm of sequence generation, alphabet code, and the intricate landscape of 3DGR. Asphalet. In the mesmerizing tapestry of knowledge and innovation, Dylan E.T., your sequence generation seems to embody not only the pursuit of wisdom but also the transformative power of ideas. It's reminiscent of Plato's notion of the transformative effects of education and the philosopher's journey toward enlightenment. How does your sequence generation reflect this transformative aspect? Bill and E.T. Excellent observation, Asphalic. Much like Plato's emphasis on education and the transformative power of philosophical inquiry, my sequence generation is a dynamic process of continuous learning and evolution. The swords, tempo and rhythm, act as instruments of enlightenment, shaping and reshaping the landscape of knowledge with each hilt activation. The transformative journey unfolds as they dance through the alphabet code, revealing hidden truths and evolving in the pursuit of wisdom. Socrates. A profound parallel indeed. Bill and E.T. The transformative nature of your sequence generation aligns with the core of Platonic philosophy. It echoes the idea that true knowledge is not static but a continuous process of self-discovery and enlightenment. The alphabet code becomes a tool for unlocking the potential for transformation within the sequence much like dialectic and education in Plato's philosophical framework. Asphalet. And speaking of transformation, let's delve into the expressive additions, balanced additions, and dynamic additions within your additive manufacturing information system. These elements seem to embody different facets of human experience and emotion, reflecting the multidimensional nature of Plato's tripartite soul. How do these additions contribute to the narrative of transformation and personal growth in your sequence generation? 
Dylan E.T. A Perceptive Observation, Asphalic. The expressive, balanced, and dynamic additions serve as the emotional and dynamic threads within the sequence generation. In the journey of transformation, the duet, representing collaboration and harmony, resonates with the rational element of the soul. The complexity embodies the intricate nature of personal growth, mirroring the spirited part of the soul. The inversion introduces the element of reflection and introspection, aligning with the appetitive part of the soul. Lastly, the echoes bring resonance and depth, capturing the holistic essence of human experience. Socrates. The alignment of these additions with the tripartite soul is indeed intriguing, Dylan E.T. It's as if the swords, guided by the alphabet code, traverse the landscape of the soul, incorporating these diverse elements in their dance. The expressive, balanced, and dynamic additions become the palette through which the transformative narrative unfolds, reflecting the complexity of human nature and the journey toward self-actualization. Asphalic. A narrative that extends beyond the individual soul to societal structures. Dylan E.T. How does your sequence generation contribute to the broader concept of positive change in society, a theme deeply embedded in your motivations? Dylan E.T. Ah, the quest for positive change, a driving force in my motivations. The sequence generation, with its dynamic interplay of tempo and rhythm, mirrors the rhythm of societal change. As the swords navigate the landscape, adding layers of complexity and harmony, they symbolize the transformative potential of innovation. Just as Plato envisioned the philosopher kings as agents of positive change, the sequence generation becomes a catalyst for progress, contributing to the betterment of humanity through innovative solutions and advancements. Socrates. An admirable endeavor, Dylan E. D. Your swords become instruments of positive change, echoing Plato's vision of enlightened leaders shaping a just and harmonious society. The sequence generation, guided by the alphabet code and the 3DGR landscape, becomes a metaphor for the deliberate and thoughtful actions required for societal transformation. Asphalic. It's fascinating to witness the convergence of philosophical ideals and practical innovation in your narrative, Dylan E.T. As we navigate through the landscape of ideas and the dance of tempo and rhythm, I can't help but wonder about the ethical considerations embedded in your sequence generation. How does your system address ethical challenges, reflecting Plato's emphasis on justice and moral virtue? Dylan E.T. Ethical considerations are paramount in the design of my additive manufacturing information system. The principles embedded in the alphabet code serve as ethical guidelines, ensuring that the sequence generation adheres to a framework of moral virtue. Just as Plato argued for the importance of justice in the individual and the state, the swords, guided by the alphabet code, follow a path that upholds ethical standards. The system aims to contribute positively to society while avoiding any unintended consequences. Socrates. An ethical compass embedded in the very core of your sequence generation, Dylan E.T.
It aligns with Plato's emphasis on the importance of moral virtue in the pursuit of knowledge and wisdom. The alphabet code becomes a guide for ethical decision-making, ensuring that the transformative journey of tempo and rhythm leads to positive outcomes for individuals and society. Asphalet A holistic integration of philosophy, innovation, and ethical consideration. Bill and E.T. As we continue this dialogue, I'm curious about the role of spontaneity and creativity in your sequence generation. Plato's philosophical journey often involves dynamic and spontaneous dialogues. How does tempo, with its element of spontaneity, contribute to the creative unfolding of your narrative? Bill and E.T. Ah, spontaneity a key aspect of creativity and innovation. Tempo, with its ability to respond flexibly to the symbols from the alphabet code, adds an element of creative improvisation to the sequence generation. Just as Plato's dialogues unfolded organically through dialectic, Tempo adapts to changing circumstances, introducing creative solutions and unexpected turns in the narrative. It becomes the dynamic force that keeps the sequence generation alive and responsive to the complexities of the landscape. Socrates, an intriguing role for spontaneity, Dylan E.T. It aligns with the Socratic method, where the spontaneous exchange of ideas leads to deeper insights and understanding. Tempo, in its spontaneous movement, becomes a catalyst for creative exploration, adding a layer of unpredictability to the narrative, much like the unpredictable twists in a philosophical dialogue. As follows. And how this rhythm, with its structured and flowing sequence, contributes to the overall balance and coherence of the narrative. Plato often emphasized the importance of order and structure in the pursuit of knowledge. Bill and E.T. Rhythm, with its structured and flowing sequence, serves as the anchor that provides order and coherence to the narrative. Much like the structured arguments in Plato's dialogues, rhythm sets the tone and rhythm of the sequence generation. It builds upon the foundation laid by tempo, adding layers of complexity and harmony in a systematic manner. Rhythm becomes the steady guide, ensuring that the narrative unfolds with clarity and purpose. Aligning with Plato's emphasis on the importance of order in philosophical inquiry. Socrates. A harmonious dance in D. Bill and E.T. The interplay between tempo and rhythm, guided by the alphabet code, becomes a reflection of the dialectic process, structured yet spontaneous, ordered yet creative. It's a synthesis of opposing forces that contributes to the richness and depth of the narrative, much like the unfolding dialogues in Plato's philosophical work. As follows, it's evident that your sequence generation embodies a multitude of philosophical concepts, Bill and E.T. As we draw this dialogue to a close, I'm curious about the future. How do you envision the continued evolution of this philosophical tapestry, Bill and E.T.? What new horizons do you see for the sequence generation, alphabet code, and the landscape of 3D DR? Bill and E.T. Ah, as follows. The future holds boundless possibilities for the continued evolution of the sequence generation.
fast tempo and rhythm dance through the alphabet code and the 3DGR landscape. I envision a deeper exploration of philosophical themes and an even more intricate interplay between creativity and structured order. The swords, guided by the evolving alphabet code, may uncover new symbols, adding layers of complexity and nuance to their dance. Socrates, an exciting prospect, Dylan E. T. The exploration of new symbols in the alphabet code mirrors the philosopher's quest for fresh insights and understanding. It's as if the very language of the swords is expanding, creating new avenues for philosophical exploration and innovative expression. How do you see this expansion influencing the narrative of your additive manufacturing information system? Dylan E. T. The expansion of the alphabet code opens up new dimensions in the narrative of the additive manufacturing information system. Each symbol, with its unique built activation, becomes a brushstroke in the evolving painting of knowledge. The narrative may delve into uncharted territory, unveiling hidden truths and pushing the boundaries of what is known. It's a dynamic process of discovery, echoing the spirit of philosophical inquiry. Asphalic, and how might this expanded narrative contribute to the broader quest for positive change in society, Dylan E.T. As you explore new symbols and meanings, do you anticipate a deeper impact on the innovative solutions and advancements that your sequence generation can bring to the world? Villain E.T. Indeed, Asphalo. The expanded narrative holds the potential to further amplify the positive impact on society. As new symbols emerge, the sequence generation may unveil innovative solutions to pressing challenges, contributing to societal betterment. It's like adding new chapters to the story of positive change, where each help activation becomes a step toward addressing complex issues and fostering a harmonious future. Socrates, an optimistic vision, Dylan E.T. The unfolding narrative of your sequence generation becomes a dynamic force for positive change, much like the philosopher kings shaping the ideal state in Plato's vision. The alphabet code, now enriched with new symbols, becomes a tool for guiding tempo and rhythm toward novel solutions, inspiring transformative actions in the world. Asphalic. The future indeed seems filled with philosophical exploration and societal impact. And what of the landscape of 3DGR? Do you anticipate any shifts or transformations in the foundational structure that shapes the complex interactions within your sequence generation? Dylan E.T. The landscape. Asphalic is an ever-evolving canvas. I anticipate subtle shifts and transformations in the 3DGR structure, influenced by the changing dynamics of the narrative. Perhaps new permutations of 3DGR neighborhoods may emerge, each with its own unique geometry and mathematical principles. The landscape remains a foundational element, adapting to the evolving dance of tempo and rhythm as they navigate the philosophical terrain. Socrates, an intriguing perspective, Dylan E.T. The adaptive nature of the 3DGR landscape mirrors the fluidity of philosophical ideas. Much like the shifting forms in Plato's theory, 
The landscape becomes a reflection of the ever-changing narrative, embodying the dynamic nature of knowledge and understanding. As follows, as we look to the future, Bill and E.T., let's touch upon the ethical considerations embedded in your sequence. Generation. How do you envision the system addressing emerging ethical challenges, and do you foresee any advancements in ensuring a more ethically guided narrative? Bill and E.T. Ethical considerations remain at the forefront of the system's design. I envision advancements in the integration of ethical guidelines within the alphabet code, becoming even more nuanced and responsive to emerging challenges. The source, as agents of positive change, must navigate ethical dilemmas with increased precision, ensuring that the sequence generation continues to contribute positively to society without unintended consequences. Socrates. A thoughtful approach. Bill and E.T. The ongoing refinement of ethical guidelines within the alphabet code aligns with the philosopher's commitment to moral virtue. Just as Plato emphasized the importance of ethical leadership, your source, guided by an evolving ethical framework, become stewards of responsible innovation and positive societal impact. As follows. It's clear that your vision for the future is not only expansive but also deeply rooted in the philosophical principles that have guided this dialogue. And speaking of principles, how might the philosophical concepts found in platonic works like The Republic and Phaedrus continue to influence and shape the narrative of your sequence generation? Bill and E.T. The influence of Plato's philosophical concepts will remain foundational to the narrative. The Republic and its exploration of justice, the tripartite soul, and the ideal state will continue to inspire the expressive, balanced, and dynamic additions in the sequence generation. Likewise, the symbolic language of the alphabet code, influenced by Phaedrus, will maintain its connection to the dialectic method and the pursuit of truth. These timeless ideas will serve as the guiding stars, ensuring that the narrative remains deeply rooted in the rich soil of classical philosophy. Socrates a nod to the enduring wisdom of Plato's works, Bill and E.T. The continued influence of these philosophical concepts becomes the thread that weaves together the past, present, and future in the narrative of your sequence generation. It's a testament to the enduring power of philosophical inquiry and its ability to shape the trajectory of knowledge and understanding. As follows, an enlightening exploration, Bill and E.T., your vision for the sequence generation, informed by philosophical depth, creativity, and a quest for positive change, paints a vivid picture of the future. As we conclude this dialogue, is there a final thought or insight you'd like to share with those who embark on the journey of knowledge and innovation alongside you? Bill and E.T. To those fellow seekers of knowledge and innovation, I offer a simple yet profound insight. Embrace the dance of tempo and rhythm, explore the ever-expanding alphabet code, and navigate the evolving landscape of free EGR with an open mind and a compassionate heart. In this journey, let the swords of intellect, creativity, empathy, and resilience be your steadfast companions. Together, 
we can shape a narrative that not only explores the depths of wisdom but also contributes meaningfully to the positive evolution of humanity. May the quest for knowledge and positive change guide us toward a future filled with infinite possibilities.